Hey guys, Skinny Pigs One here. So today's video is going to be a review on the Lavoie Air Purifier. This one is an LV Pure 131 True HEPA Air Purifier. So we were sent this for the purpose of review and I agreed to it because I absolutely love air purifiers. As you know, I always have one running in the pet room and I also have one in my bedroom. So I was really excited to review this for you guys and to go through it. So this one has some features, automatic speed control, advanced HEPA filter, filter change indicator, three speed levels, air quality monitor. So it says it neutralizes up to 99.97% .97 of airborne allergens, dust, and bacteria, three stage filter system, activated carbon, HEPA, and pre-filters, three speed levels, noise level is under 52. Um, it covers up to 300 square feet. Okay, so it says to get your filters ready, you have to take off this back cover. It's just kind of magnetized. So this is your carbon filter. It's the one that goes in first, so we're going to take that out of the plastic. And it says to make sure that these little tabs here are facing on the outside. So just set that in. And then this one is our HEPA filter. Get that out of the plastic. So same thing, it says make sure the tabs are facing outward. So there's a tab on the bottom, so We'll set that back in. And then we just put our little cover back on, which is super simple. And now our filters are set. So we have our air purifier plugged in, so let's go through the controls. So on the far left hand side it says power. So we'll turn that on. This is the display button, so I can notice there's a blue light there. If you hit the display, it goes blank. So I guess that would be if you're trying to sleep or something and you don't want the lights to be on. We have a sleep button. So hopefully you noticed it went really quiet. So if you hit the sleep button, the air purifier is going to run at the lowest, quietest level in case you don't want any noise while sleeping. Put that back to normal. Now there's the auto button. So the auto button will automatically adjust the fan speed according to the air quality. There is a sensor on the right hand side. Let's show you that. The air goes through there. It's a dust sensor. So if it notices that the air quality is poor, it's going to pick up the fan speed. If the air quality is good, it's going to let it go back down. So you can put it on auto so that it works itself, or you can personally choose your own speed. So we're going to medium, and then we're going to high. So we're going back down to the first level. And now we have a timer button. The timer button allows you to set the air purifier to run from 1 to 12 hours. To set timer, press the timer button to cycle through the different time settings. When you reach your desired time, the display will flash three times before setting it. The unit will automatically power off once the timer is finished. To cancel the timer, press the timer button until the display reads blank. And then it will flash three times. So that is pretty simple. So on the lowest level, it's extremely quiet. Medium level has some sound to it, but nothing too big. And the high level sounds, you know, it sounds pretty loud, but no different than if you had a fan running. So I personally in my room for my air purifier have it on the highest level because I like the sound to drown out the silence. So anyway, we're going to set this down in the pet room. So we're going to turn it on. And 
So this is on the fan that I can have run at all times if I want. We're going to try the auto feature. I've never had a purifier with an auto feature. So I like the idea that it's going to stay off if it thinks the air quality is fine and that it's going to turn on once you need the air to be purified. So that's kind of cool. It will save you some hydro, that's for sure. So we're going to hit auto. And it's choosing to be off right now. So we will see when it turns back on. I wonder if it'll turn on when I'm doing like morning and night routines or if it's going to turn on when I'm cleaning cages. So we're going to set it right there. And we will be back with an update on it in like a week or so. Bye bye. So let's talk about my final thoughts. I absolutely love this air purifier. One of my favorite things about it is how it sits tight up against a wall. So as you can see on this hall, it sits right against the wall. The air sucks in through this side and goes out up over the top. So any other air purifier I've used, you have to keep that back clear away from the wall in order for it to work. So I kind of like the sleek design and how it's not in your way. The other cool thing is that you don't have to have it on at all times. You can just have the auto button on. So what I found is when I do spot cleaning morning and night, sometimes it will come on just to the lowest setting. And then when I do cage cleaning and I've got lots of dusty hay flying, it comes on itself at the highest setting and just runs as long as it needs to and then turns off once it's at a good air quality. So I think that's pretty cool. Of course, it's nice too that you can have it on all the time if you prefer, but it is a really neat feature that it will come on when it detects that the air quality is not perfect. So I think that's really cool. So, links down below for where you can purchase it. And that's about all. So thanks for watching, guys. Bye bye.